And hello again. I guess if Catherine's going to be the answer lady, I'm going to be the Ask Jack guy. What we've got is another query from an email about how to do it. So what we're going to do is share it with everyone that's interested by watching this video. All right, before we get into the meat of this situation, I am a trained professional. Do not try this at home. It's not a good idea to go and pull the flippers out of your river carriage. I'm willing to do it for you, and if you're really brave and really good, you can do it too. All right, once again, we've really gone into this one. This is off of a river carriage, and you can see the discoloration from the corrosion that got inside of it. And this flipper was completely frozen. Uh, I need to learn to do the before, before I show you the after, but let's see if we can do it this way. This is a f the finger before, and these are the fingers after, having worked with this to free it up, and you can see all the crud that I've gotten on to me. And you can also see, I haven't finished yet, but right in there, you can see where the corrosion had this flipper. Now, this is the flipper that was okay, and there was nothing wrong with it. Now, this is the one that I've repaired. Now, you see the difference between, and I'll get this one working the same way, don't worry. But this is the difference, this is what I can do for you when it's absolutely hopeless. This one, it's going to be an ugly duckling because of this discoloration. But I'll put it back in the Marvel Mystery Oil right by itself. That'll treat the metal for me so that this corrosion will stop and it'll go back to being a functional river carriage. 